Well, as election season slowly but surely approaches in November and with the uncertainty of how COVID-19 will impact the county, by then Beltrami County officials discussed a voting update on what Beltrami County plans to do to keep voters safe. Now today, Beltrami County officials heard from Jody Treat, where she explained certain concerns and steps that the county can take to ensure voting is a safe process for everyone. And with voters' concerns, we just want to keep our polling places safe, um, the voters comfortable in coming in, adhering to social distancing, the sanitizing processes. Uh, with the additional money that we would have for PPE, we could um, put up the sneeze guards to protect against on the uh, electronic poll books or the the rosters, the paper rosters. We could also purchase, for example, disposable pens so that as a, a voter comes in and votes their ballot, the pen can be thrown in the garbage and the, the voter can be on their way. That pen then does not have to be sanitized. It can just be gotten rid of. In addition, Beltrami County has about eight townships that have the option of becoming a mail ballot precinct, which would limit the amount of people physically going in to vote. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.